Hello there, friend. Welcome to the homestead. It's official. Spring has sprung on the homestead this week, and with it has come the blessing of an overabundance of eggs. We are eating eggs daily, and in as many ways as we possibly can, and yet our refrigerator is still busting at the seams. And if you have chickens, then I can bet there's a good chance you're having the same problem. If you can call it that. The trick, though, is finding the eggs. It usually involves a daily egg hunt around the homestead. Our ladies have mostly rejected the nest boxes and have decided that this trailer filled with goat hay, for example, is a much better nesting option. Today, I thought it was as good a time as any to share with you how we preserve our overabundance of eggs each spring so that we have farm fresh eggs available to us in the winter when our hens stop laying. The method I'm gonna walk you through today is called water glassing. It's a preservation method that was made popular in the early 1800s. Water glassing only requires three things. Farm fresh eggs, water, and hydrated lime. Hang around to the end of the video to see how well the eggs from last spring have held up. Today, since I'm using a three gallon bucket, I'm going to start by filling my bucket with five quarts of water. How much water you need will depend on the size of your container, but always make sure to measure the water in quarts so that you can figure out the ratio of hydrated lime to add. Food grade hydrated lime, otherwise known as calcium hydroxide or pickling lime, can be found in grocery, feed, or hardware stores and is also available online. I ordered a 50 pound bag from Azure Standard. I'll leave the link to it down below. And I can tell you one thing, I'm not going to run out of it anytime soon. The ratio of water to lime is one quart water to one ounce of lime. So here I'm adding five ounces of lime to my five quarts of water. The key to eggs lasting up to a year, and even beyond that, is to use fresh eggs that are clean but have never been washed. You don't want to wash the bloom off of the eggs or the lime will get into your eggs and ruin them. The eggs from last year that you'll see at the end of this video were started in April of last year. So here, I'd love it if you would amuse me in the upcoming footage as I reenact a year-long life cycle of my water-glassed eggs. Here we have year old eggs. They've been sitting at room temperature undisturbed for about 11 months. One last step before they can be used is to give them a really good rinse. You don't want any lime ending up in your food. If you've enjoyed water glassing eggs with me today, then check out these other videos on food preservation. Thank you for joining me today. 
May the Lord bless you and keep you.